Welcome back to Crypto Gains for another video. Bringing you some crypto therapy coming up close and personal. <laughs> I just got back from the gym, so I thought, you know, I'll come back, I'll give you a quick crypto therapy video. Uh, how to uh, pick yourself up when all you see is red or red day or just red in the market when, you know, your prices are falling. But before I go there, just a quick one. Repeat after me. Thank you, universe. I I'm going to keep saying it. Law of attraction. Don't repeat that bit. <laughs> repeat this bit. Thank you, universe, for everything that I have, I've had, and what I'm about to receive. I will keep it short. The universe has unlimited ways of giving me money. I'm so excited about how the universe will bring me money next. Is it flickering already? This thing has a mind of its own. It just chooses to flicker. Don't repeat that bit. <laughs> I'm a money magnet. I'm a wealth creator. I love money. Money loves me. Money is my friend. And so forth. How to pick yourself up when all you keep seeing is red days. And I get it. Because when you invest money, you, you know, and then you see red, you feel like, are you doing the right thing? Are you buying the right coins? How comes that coin's pumping and my coin isn't? Maybe I'm in the wrong, uh, the wrong coin. You see, what I do when uh, I see red days, you know, especially bad red days, is I take a look at my entire portfolio as a whole. You know, I use an app called Delta, which allows me to skip the time frame so I can go from like a daily time frame to a monthly time frame, a yearly time frame or all. So when I switch it to all, I can take a look at some of the coins that I'm down in. And what I tend to do is if I'm down 50 percent or more, I'll buy more. And just think, because this is how I think, I think to myself, that hundred pounds or a hundred dollars that I put in right now. What could it be worth in the future? Powerful. Trust me, it is. Because many people don't think like that. When you see down markets, you just want to sell. You want to get out the coin because you feel like you're wasting your time on this coin. That one's pumping. Actually, let me sell these, uh, this bag and put it into that coin there. Nuh-uh. That's the wrong way about it. Because then what happens is you see you rush to put your money in that coin that's already pumped up. It falls on your damn face. And then all of a sudden, your coin is pumping. Give it time. As time goes on, you will see your coins move. This is what happens in cycles. Sometimes coins take longer than others to go up and down. It's not about where you are right now. It's about where you will be in the future. It's a powerful sentence. Like, please, seriously take that in when I say that to you. It's not about where you are now with your crypto portfolio. You may see a thousand pounds or your portfolio might say 300 quid. Your portfolio might say 20,000 or 50,000. Whatever it says right now, it's not about what it is right now. It's about where it's going to be in 2024, 2025. And, you know, I keep trying to share you helpful pro uh, projects. Check my top 20 uh, holdings that's my biggest holdings. It's a powerful video. It shows you what I'm actually buying. It shows you what I'm sharing with my Patreons when I actually buy uh, coins. I share you many coins on my channel. Reviews, high risk, low risk sometimes. But, you know, my channel is a high risk. I'm looking for those 100Xs. So you're going to see a lot of high risk projects. But uh, essentially, it's about what you really put in your money into. And, you know, these high risk ones, you, t you, you, you know, you, you spend a little bit. You don't go crazy on them. To be fair, in all the crypto that we invest, we, again, I've got to say, you know, only be investing what you can afford to lose. And you hear it all the time. You hear YouTube, uh, it's boring. Now. It just keeps telling me what I already know. But even though people know that, they still invest 1,000, 2,000, 3,000. And all of a sudden, you, you know, you start to panic when you see a red day. But there's no need to panic. If you feel and believe that the projects that you are investing in will do well in the future, just, you know, have that faith. Give it time. And, you know, take the opportunity to buy more. Remember, you're buying businesses. You're not buying coins and, you know, you're buying, you're looking at companies and that's the mindset. You're buying a company that could potentially do exceedingly well or extremely well, whichever way you want to put it in the future.
So I just thought I'd bring this to you. Hopefully it just helps you on your journey, relaxes you a bit. Don't worry, you know, taking the opportunities to buy these coins whilst they're uh, still cheap, I'm still doing so. I'm still stacking up my bags because at some point, there has to come a turning point. There has to be a point where, we, where you know, we all say, actually, I'm not going to buy anymore now because, you know, the market's just going up and up and up unless you want to keep buying all the way up. There has to be a point in life where you say, okay, I'm just not going to buy now. I'm just going to let this ride all the way to the top and start working out when I'm taking profits. So I'll let you know when I'm taking profits. I'll keep sharing helpful videos, helpful uh, analysis on Bitcoin and the charts so we can get good insight as to where we are in the crypto space. And hopefully that guides you on your journey and you can decide when you want to take profits. Guys, I'm going to leave it here. <laughs> if it was helpful, drop that like, give me a subscribe. Hope you have a good day. Last time I recorded it was nighttime. It's morning now I've got nice sunshine in the back and just about see it uh, but have a good day big up to you all stay healthy stay wealthy and i'll see you in the next one cheers